rip current is water that's actually going back from the beach in a channel. The waves come in and they're pretty broad based, and, but the water can come to, sometimes go back out in a very small, forceful channel, and that's what really riptide is. Uh, riptides you can recognize by the actual pattern of water, water flow, and lifeguards are trained to do that. All drownings uh, that have occurred in this area have been when the lifeguards are off duty. Belmar being one of the busiest beaches uh, in the shore area, we've been fortunate fortunate enough not to have any drownings on duty. Everybody's ability in the water is different, but no matter how good of a swimmer you are, you, the ocean's so powerful and, and rip currents can, uh, can pull out the best of swimmers, the most experienced of swimmers. So you really have to be uh, aware of your surroundings and know the strength and powers of the ocean. Uh, when you get caught in a rip current, you know, the best thing to do is not to panic. Um, obviously we're hoping that the lifeguards are on duty and they'll be able to see that, you know, before it gets into a, a life or death situation and be, you know, there to help you. But don't panic, let it take you out. Only you'll probably go out no further than the jetty. Um, swim parallel to shore and signal for help. You know, if nobody's around, signal for help. Yell for help, wave for help. Let somebody know that, you know, you need some assistance to get back to shore.